good to see you exploring space, little kitty. May I know what you're searching for? Black hole. <laughs> you can't find a black hole through this ordinary telescope. Why? Well, that's because it's far, far away from our solar system, and we should be thankful for that. Thankful? Yes, little kitty. Thankful. Hey friends, so in today's episode, let us see why it's essential to maintain a distance from these giant destructors and answer an apocalyptic question. What if a black hole entered our solar system? Zoom in! Black hole, we already learned so much about them in our previous videos, right from their inception to their destruction and even explored the possibility of you falling into one. And what we learned from these videos is that the black hole is an extremely dense object hovering in space from which nothing can escape, not even light. But what's more dangerous than its eating capacity is its free-flying nature. Yes, a supermassive black hole, earlier believed to be situated in the center of a far-off galaxy, officially called E2261-BCG, has finally vanished. This incident has now led scientists to believe that the black hole might be floating through space. This leads us to a question. What if a free-spirited rogue black hole heads all the way into our solar system, which consists of eight planets, hundreds of moons, hundreds of thousands of asteroids, and billions of comets orbiting our sun. Well, in that case, we can see only one possibility, and that is destruction. Yes, my dear friends, if a massive black hole like the one residing at the center of our Milky Way galaxy entered our solar system, there is no way out for us. In fact, it can start harming us even before entering our solar system. Yes, as supermassive black holes have stars, planets, asteroids and comets orbiting around them, all the debris that a supermassive black hole picked up on its way through space would bombard our solar system. And in case our Earth is lucky to not get hit by this space debris, then wait until the black hole gets closer as its gravity will start pulling the cosmic bodies in our solar system, altering their orbiting path. Soon, we on Earth will be caught under heavy comet strikes and meteor showers. Meanwhile, the other planets will start colliding with each other before their remains get pulled inside the black hole. Even a massive planet like Jupiter won't be able to escape its power as it would pull all the gas from the giant planet turning it into a swirling hot disk. It would keep pulling until it consumes Jupiter entirely. Things won't be good for the Earth too. Yes, as the black hole gets closer, its increasing intense gravitational pull will cause massive earthquakes and volcanic eruptions. And upon reaching Earth's orbit, our planet will be doomed reduced to a smoldering, uninhabitable, magma-laden rock, with Mercury and Venus soon following its suit. However, our super sun might not give up so fast without giving a tough fight. But after a hard-fought gravitational tug-of-war between them, our sun won't be able to survive this level of energy and will be ripped apart before getting consumed by the mighty black hole. Trivia time! Did you know the unicorn, the closest known black hole to Earth, 
may be the galaxy's smallest? Yes, this black hole is located about 1500 light years away from Earth and is roughly three times the mass of our Sun. Hope you learned something new today. Until next time, it's me Dr. Binox zooming out. Uh, never mind. <laughs>